Hello, everybody. We are going to talk about Bootstrap 5. And Bootstrap 5 is the future. In this video, you will see the best tools for using Bootstrap 5 in a very cost-effective way and incredibly fast and efficient. You will also see why C Sharp is the future and why everybody's talking about Bootstrap 5 and C Sharp, especially .NET 5, ASP.NET Core. These tools are the future. And in this video, you will see why Bootstrap 5 and C Sharp and ASP.NET Core is what everyone in the next year is going to be developing in. It's just the best, period. Nothing else is necessary. Okay, so without any further ado, let's continue. So I'm, using, I'm going to show you guys how Bootstrap 5 works. Right here, I'm just going to open a blank screen and this is bootstrap studio there's a cheaper version that costs 30 dollars, and then there's a more expensive version that costs um 60 and you can upgrade and this thing is drag and drop website designing it just cannot be better than that so imagine instead of writing C css and html with this thing you just drag and drop and call it a day and that's it. You don't need to ever bother again with the problems of designing your, your HTML and your Bootstrap 5 and all that stuff. You can always choose between Bootstrap 5 and Bootstrap 4.6. For the purpose of this video, we will be using Bootstrap 5 for demonstration purposes but also Bootstrap 4.6. And for a short demo, we will just go with 4.6, then we can switch to five. It's basically the same. So here we go, especially for the grid, because we're just gonna talk about the grid. So here we go in the grid mode. It's very simple, guys. It is just drag and drop. I'm gonna do it on Bootstrap 4.6 and five so you guys can see so here we go just grab a row and we just drop it there and then we drop another row and then we drop another row and it's super easy to build a user interface using this tool the code you guys are, let's let me show you guys where the code's at so you guys can see the power of this thing I'm going to just drop a few columns here. Just drop a column in each and every one of these. And here we go. As you guys can see, this is pure HTML. It has everything, every single thing. This is why this tool is so powerful because it's editing HTML with a drag and drop functionality. Wait till you see how great this thing is. I'm not being sponsored here, guys. I'm not sponsored would be great if I would be sponsored, but this is totally free. So the full code is right here. When you put your mouse over it, it freaking highlights exactly what you need, what, what you're targeting. So you never get confused what's on the UI and what's on the code side. That is freaking awesome. Bootstrap 5 and Bootstrap 4.6 and C Sharp are awesome languages because this integrates perfectly well with C Sharp and ASP.NET Core and .NET 5 because they all run on Bootstrap 5 or 4.6 and most of the, break, uh, the changes are not breaking. So here we go. Let's drop the, let's, let's, let me show you guys the power of this thing. So I just click here and immediately this menu appears right here. This is just for zooming in, zooming out, switching to portrait, fitting the canvas to the screen. This is important. And other viewing options like box model, outline grid, and all this stuff. You can turn the outline of the grid off if you don't want to see it. It's useful. So here we go. 
you go on top of a column and now you can add columns just like that. And not just that, you could even remove them just by pressing control C. And then you can move the columns position and put the column wherever the heck you want to put the column, wherever you're happy, man. That's where you can put the column. And this thing just adapts to whatever place you want to put your columns. And you can make the columns bigger or smaller. You can make them super small. You can make them super big. And you can move the column positions like I just show you guys. So let me just make this start looking like it used to look. Um, so we put this here and then we put this one a little bit bigger. So that's your regular tree row column. Usually this was used to be done in code, but now you don't need to do that in Bootstrap 5 or Bootstrap 4. You can totally do this without code and it will run fantastically well, especially on the ASP.NET Core and C Sharp. Everyone's talking about it. It is awesome. It is just incredible. Okay, so right here, we can just drag and drop more stuff. Pardon my mouse. Okay. Um, you just type button and you get a button and you can just drop your buttons there, my friend, and, and call it a freaking day. And another beauty of this thing is that, for example, let's suppose you just want to style every row to be centered, right? Because why not? Why not just center? You can copy it and change your bootstrap five really easily. Check it out. There you go. Every single row now is completely aligned automatically. Every single button you put there, it will be aligned. And now you can put some paragraphs if you want to. And they will align perfectly well like magic baby so there you go guys that's how easy it is to do it in bootstrap 4.6 but now let's try and see bootstrap 5 how would it be on bootstrap 5 it is very easy but as you guys can see building a ui using bootstrap studio is just insanely easy and yes this is responsive guys this is totally responsive it adapts to most screen sizes so don't be afraid of using this when you're developing your applications the grid is a very powerful bootstrap 5 and bootstrap 4 tool it is amazing so um here you can see your css and you can search for your css and you can edit your css you can even edit the source code here and it allows you so much flexibility, so many options. It is amazing for the price. There is no subscription fee, guys. This is totally one-time purchase. And uh, yeah, so basically, it's an amazing pro project, product. Um, I'm a sucker for it. I paid for it. It's awesome. And have a great day, guys. That's, uh, oh yeah, let's show you guys the Bootstrap 5 version of this thing. Okay, guys, so we're in Bootstrap 5. Let's add some columns, start making a UI really fast. Let's add some rows. You got to start with the good old rows. Just row, row your, your boat gently down the stream and add the good old columns. Call it a good old day, man, because that's how we roll. So now we're just going to add 
a few extra columns so we can add more stuff. There we go. It's super easy, guys. This is Bootstrap 5. Bootstrap 5, my people. And you can just drag and drop this in ASP.NET Core. It's that easy. It's that simple. It's just incredible. That's why everyone's talking about it. Okay, so I'm just going to drop some buttons so you guys can see the power of this madness. Okay, now, yeah, that's my dog. So let's, uh, I don't know what she, why, why is she mad? Okay, so let's uh, text align this bad boy. Center, automatically centered, baby. That's Bootstrap 5 for you. And remember, you can just drag and drop this thing with C Sharp and you can just make it all in one back-end language, and you can even use C-sharp as a JavaScript. And C-sharp is super easy to use. Not just that, but Bootstrap is also super easy to use, and especially Bootstrap 5. So, guys, this is Bootstrap. I hope you guys liked it. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Have a great day, guys. Yep, got to press a button here somewhere. There we go. Goodbye.